It is 652 Fort Myers, Florida, where I used to live and work yes. before coming here. I love Fort Myers. Beautiful That's, place. It is gorgeous. Yes. So very different from what we have going on for us today mm -hmm. as far as we're not going to see a lot of blue sky. We'll get some sun breaks in the mix there, but generally we do have that lovely Florida heat and humidity going for us. So there's that temperatures already in the low to mid 70s across the area. The dew points not far behind. So that just gives us a good idea of how muggy it is. The radar here pretty quiet, so we could see a couple of showers this morning. I think what we can really expect though would be thunderstorms to ramp up this afternoon as the temperatures really get going. So we do have this cold front on the way. We're expecting the afternoon storms will be well out ahead of the front and then a line moves through with the front late tonight. So we do have this area of yellow indicating a slight risk for those strong to severe storms, Baltimore and then places to the west here and then a marginal risk. So let's time it out and you'll see why those are kind of divvied up that way. So by really late morning, early afternoon, seeing a nice dose of sunshine that will allow temperatures to really climb upper 80s are the highs for the day, and that just contributes to how unstable it will be. So some scattered storms later in the afternoon and then in the evening, Western Maryland, you are up first with this line of storms ahead of the front. 10 o'clock moving into places like Hagerstown, Frederick, Westminster, and then even later, for the Baltimore area, for the eastern shore, places further off to the east. Now what happens is after sunset, we lose the daytime heating and things get a little bit more stable, meaning possible, possibly those thunderstorms will break apart by the time they get to us. However, we're still expecting those afternoon thunderstorms to pop up. 87 the high for today, tonight dipping down into the upper 60s. Normal high for this time of year is 78. Will be above that for the first half of the weekend and then below that by the second half of the weekend. Overall, we see a drop in humidity even though by tomorrow. So more comfortable conditions are just around the corner.